Now I have Palmi Saha who joins us from Guwahati. I also have Kamlesh Sutar who joins us from Mumbai because this clearly, according to the Shiv Sena, that is the Uddhav Thakre faction. They say game on. They say they have the numbers and they'll be able to prove the numbers on the floor of the house. In fact, that's something that that uh, Sharad Pawar, the NCP Supremo, also made it very clear. Numbers are proven on the floor of the house, not in letters that is sent to the deputy speaker or claims that are made in hotel lobbies. But that picture at the hotel lobby is, is very interesting at the Radisson Blue Hotel. Is that picture, Kamlesh, an indication it's game over for Uddhav Thakre? But, or is it Uddhav Thakre, uh, Nana Patole, the Congress, and of course Sharad Pawar NCP, together it's still game on? Well, uh, what was appearing uh, till uh, some time back that Uddhav Thakre and his uh, lieutenant are leaving the battlefield. Uh, we saw uh, yesterday Uddhav Thakre said that he is willing to quit the chief minister's chair. He also quit the official residence Varsha. He went back to Matoshri. Sanjay Raut said that we are willing to walk out of the MVA alliance. We thought that they are walking out of the battlefield, but just now, Gaurav, the update that is coming in Shiv Sena has approached the deputy speaker. The news that we were just breaking, they have approached with a disqualification notice to 12 of the MLAs that are in Chinde camp, including the man uh, at the moment, Ekna Chinde himself and his trusted lieutenant, uh, uh, Ekna Chinde's trusted lieutenant, Bharat Gogavla and others. The Shiv Sena clearly wants to drag this battle. Uh, because, you know, a senior leader was saying that the more you drag the battle, uh, the more there is possibility of a rebellion collapsing. So, they want to drag it. Uh, it's now very clear this is going to go into the courtrooms. The Shiv Sena wants to make it legal. They have approached the deputy speaker. Yesterday, I spoke to the deputy speaker when he exclusively spoke to us. He said that he has already accepted the letter by Shiv Sena to appoint Ajay Chaudhary in place of Ekna Chinde as a leader of, uh, of the legislative party leader. But then there was a meeting of uh, the rebel MLAs held in Guwahati where they proposed Ekna Chinde's name and it was seconded by other MLAs as the legislative party leader. So that's somewhere uh, Shiv Sena feels is a uh, uh, you know, breach of uh, the party discipline and that is why they've approached the deputy speaker. Now, deputy speaker has already accepted it. That is an interesting point to note. The deputy speaker's post is with the NCP. Remember, Sharad Pawar today said that F numbers are not proven in hotel lobbies. They are proven on the floor of the house. Let them come yes. back. We'll show the numbers. That is what Sanjay Raut is saying. So the battle is not over as yet. They'll have to come to Mumbai because ultimately it has to happen because if the numbers are to be proven... It's the numbers game have on. to be proven on the floor of the house and till Absolutely. that happens, the match is not over. It's game on. It's almost like a T20 match being fought to the last ball. Who will hit the last six out of the park or who will be clean bowled? We'll be reporting on that very closely. But Polymy, two more independent MLAs. Information just coming. Information you're breaking. Two more MLAs have, independent MLAs have reached Gohati. Now, is this... Is this just narrative building or psychological pressure that's being put on Uddhav Thakre? Or is, does this actually hold a decisive edge? Because as far as anti-defection law is concerned, as of now, Iknat Shinde needs 37 or 37 plus to be comfortable. Well, uh, first of all, uh, Gaurav, uh, the news is that two more independent MLAs could be on their way to Guwahati as we speak. So uh, the numbers over here at the Radisson Hotel could be swelling. But as far as, uh, you know, the numbers uh, growing over here is concerned, what Eknath Shinde is trying to achieve is to ensure that he has maximum numbers on his side. This is not just about, of course, a big chunk of it and a prominent chunk of it is about achieving that two-third majority figure. As far as the legislative party of the Shiv Sena is concerned, where he's touched that mark of 37 right now, but he'd want to better that score just to be comfortable in uh, the numbers that he has. But in terms of, of course, approaching and getting others on board as well. Now, there are seven others uh, inside the Radisson Hotel. Two more could possibly be on their way. What he's trying to do is build a unit, a faction, which, of course, uh, you know, when it goes uh, to any bigger national party, quote-unquote, for uh, the kind of support in order to form government, uh, then he has the numbers. He can, of course, uh, wield his influence his clout and he has a bargaining uh, power as well which doesn't just rest on 37 it has much much more on his uh, side so he's definitely okay. trying to uh, showcase over here that he is a leader in himself and he is a leader who's just not got his Shiv on board he can manage to bring others on board as well Gaurav Savant